What are you doing today, Trixie? We want it. We need it. The Trixie from us. What are you watching, Trixie? You fat out. <laughs> <laughs>
Actually, oh, that the voice he had, it's almost more menacing the way, because now it's just like he's an old man with a booming voice. Um, yeah, he's just got this weighty presence. Uh, that, and it, I'm, it feels like um, just a really classic, like, like what we've been accustomed to from the era of classic films in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. It just has that feel of, this is a classic film you've got to see. See the original. Uh, well, uh, you'll let us know. Yeah, they, I mean, they both have been highly requested. Mm -hmm. um, I'm guessing, obviously, just the new one has much better graphics. Mm -hmm. uh, sure, of course, uh, than the original, and probably more palatable for people because it's within a contemporary construct as far as the filmmaking is concerned. So this one was made in 1990. It uh, looked a lot older than that. Bollywood stuff <clears throat> often looks older than uh -huh. it actually is. Uh huh. Um, uh, but this is the original. It came out in 1990. Read the synopsis. A young boy's quest for revenge leads him to become a gangster as an adult. And with each day, he becomes more and more like his enemies. Can he find vengeance and redemption? Almost similar to the KGF kind of, uh... Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Also, why was it yeah. like, in Sacred Games, is that like an homage to, uh... Or is I don't know if it's a name? common name. Gatunde? Gatunde. Yeah, because we've seen that name in some other things as well. And my suspicion okay. is it's just... It's, it's probably a, a pretty common a common name. Uh, I didn't know. Unless it like a, a unless it's been used enough in some films that in Sacred Games they used it because it would harken back to some of these iconic name characters that, that portray that character. I don't know. Clearly, I don't know. And I I didn't recognize anybody else in there, but something mm -hmm. tells me a stupid baby's gonna say, "Hey, you missed dot dot dot." Oh yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, you probably missed like Rithic. <laughs> In his underwear. Yeah, who was his body double? That's what I want to know. Made Made Madevi? Okay, why do I know that name? Sounds like Shri Devi, but it's Madevi. Yeah, no, and I bet it's more I Madavi. I don't understand. I, I, I mean, I don't, I, I don't see anything uh, in her work that we've Was seen. she the one in the trailer, I assume, who the minute her face was on the screen was, like, strikingly pretty? Probably. Yeah. And also, I, I, I did enjoy, like, at first it was a little weird, but I did start enjoying that dance that that guy was I doing. I did, too. So I'm wondering if... I like, wanted to see more of that yeah. number. Especially when he started doing the... He's the coconut seller, whatever he was saying. I'm interested. Yeah. Yeah, so let us know, like, um, if, if we watch any Agnipath one, are either of them worth watching? If so, should we start with the original, or is the, can you just go straight to the remake, if that one's better? You know what I think we should do? And it may be with this film, you can tell us if you want us to do that, and we can do it with more than one. I think it would be cool if we did, like, a lot of people were saying, you should have watched the original Drishiam. Remember? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. What if we did a film like this, where we back-to-back, -back watch them like same day or the very next day we double feature it we watch the original and then we watch the remake and we review both of them and make a comparison of the two films and say which of the two do we prefer them could be a possibility yeah i don't know if it would be with this or if it'd be something else. right but there's film. enough i mean there's plenty of films that have three been hour remade film. so i'm sure the other one's three hours so that's six yep. hours in a day yep. another 30 to an hour for a review if you're reviewing two films <laughs> right <laughs> And then <laughs> 10 hours of editing uploading. of the upload. <laughs> <laughs> Which, I just don't do anything when he does that. Uh, but yeah, you can let us know um, how it is uh, in Big B's career. Is this... Yeah. I mean, it had to be good enough for that they'd want to remake it, right? You would think. You would think, unless there are some times when a filmmaker decides this movie could have been so much better and I want to, I want to make it now. So they do a remake of something that actually didn't do well. Mm -hmm. And the remake is fantastic. Yeah. But I don't think that's the case. I think they just remake classics. And it, it seems to happen quite a bit. Yeah. Or they remake South Indian content. Which yeah, that happens a lot. And we know that that's not... Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Some people are very upset. <laughs> but <laughs> Understandable. <Yeah. laughs> it's like, yeah, we made this film a long time ago and no one paid attention. And now because they did it in Bollywood, thanks, guys. We get that. We yeah, really do. I understand. Uh, but yeah, please let us know. Uh, also, is that dance worth reacting to? Cause that looked... <laughs> if we could just do that, that would qualify as a 90s. <laughs> I want to know, because we haven't seen it yet, mm -hmm. speaking of 90s, mm -hmm. does Big B have a 90s music video? He probably does. I've got to see it. Have we reacted to any of his music videos? 
Because I know he has them, and it's been requested. Yeah, people have mentioned, did you know that Big B can sing, and we got to do a Big B. Apparently, he's, apparently he also sang the National Anthem, too. I'd love to hear that. Yeah, that'd be cool, right? Yeah, but I would particularly like to see. Like him dancing and I, singing. I want to see, will he give Akshay a run for his money? Because right now, Akshay is the king of the 90s music videos. Well, they say it's actually good guy. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's, Diva. he is... I mean, we love actually. We know him more, but they say the king of the '90s was actually well. He died. gave us a good turn on that one we did recently. Yeah, apparently, and there's other better ones where he's actually more. We have to. So right now, the reigning crown oh, is, yeah. is on Akshay's head. Oh, of course, yeah. And even though it wasn't a music video we reacted to, when we did the not the, the, the contest about the laughing video, and he popped up in the tub, that just elevated him even more for me in the '90s. And you look like him. Apparently, did you see? Mm -hmm. Somebody did a blend. They didn't do it, but they put him and Saif Ali Khan and then put equals and used my picture when I was like 19. <laughs> and I looked at it and I'm like, wow, it actually does. I would love, hey, somebody get a picture, get a picture of uh, Akshay and Saif Ali Khan from the 90s and then do a blend. And I want to see if it's close. And let us know which uh, Big B. Yeah, music uh, video. Music video. I want a Big B music video. Let it make sure it's good. Yeah, please give us his best. <laughs> We're looking for the crown.